Thailand is renowned for its amazing street food with hundreds of little pop-up kitchens serving a wide variety of authentic Thai dishes. Like the popular Pad Thai stalls serving up a mixed variety of stir-fried noodles. Or your fresh fish restaurants with their freshly caught fish on display, cooked to order or ready to go seafood dishes. In this video, we're going to look at three different types of Thai street foods that would probably be more appealing to Thai people than it would to your average Westerners. Irrespective of what your personal opinion may be, they are all very popular when it comes to Thai street food. It is very unlikely that you would find crocodile meat on the shelves of any of Britain's high street shops or supermarkets, mainly because it's not native to Britain or Europe in that case and has never really been incorporated into our diet. That having been said, it is also very unlikely that you will find crocodiles in the wild in Thailand. These days they're mostly bred on crocodile farms and mass produced to keep up with the high demand on their well sought after meat and hides. Personally, I find the best way to cook crocodile is to fillet it, cut it into about one inch cubes, marinate it in some crushed garlic and some fresh crushed herbs, put it on skewers and simply barbecue it. If however you want to get a little bit more adventurous, here is a few ideas for you.
<laughs> What's it like? That's it. These, my good friends, are real bugs, scorpions, caterpillars, flies, basically creepy crawlies. And if, like me, when you first come across one of these stools, you think that must just be a gimmick, there's no way people could eat them, you would be greatly mistaken. I have literally seen people buy these by the bag load and literally munch away at them like it was a bag of popcorn. Like you're eating the shell of a prawn, but the, the juice is not as delightful as a prawn. <laughs> no, I, I take your word for it. Oh God! Oh, Here you go, what's that? Oh, no, God. Now we're in my medium one and now we're going to hit the head on a walk. Whatever in there. Leo, cheese, Thailand style. Ready? You guys, man. Oh, the head. Oh, the head. <laughs> oh, the head. Those darn heads. Some of those materials. They have protein. You guys are just wrong. I'm not sure what this little sucker is, but I'm sure it's going to be great. Really Want to know what they taste like? Well, to be honest, I took a mouthful, chewed half of it, and spat the rest out. So, really sorry, but I can't give the answer to that question. Want to know how to cook them? Mm. Get a deep fat fryer, chuck them in, and hope for the best. Personally, stick to your pork scratchings if I was you. Sins. I'm trying some chicken leg. These are chicken legs. Whether you like it or not, look at that. Chicken leg. Mm. I do try some weird things, and this is one of them. It's going to get messy. I've got to pick it up with my fingers, but I'm going to try a bit of the sauce. delicious. I can't film. I need the chicken legs. Let's try it. I don't know how I'm going to tackle this. Tastes like feet. <laughs>